We are going to dive into the epic battle between man and machine, where one human outwits artificial intelligence with a mind-blowing strategy in the ancient game of Go. This is AI vs. Human, the ingenious strategy that helped a human beat AI in Go. The game has captivated humans for millennia, with its simple rules yet complex strategies. It's a game where even our most advanced AI has met its match. But let me tell you a little story about a machine learning prodigy called Google's AlphaGo Zero. Believe it or not, this clever bot not only taught itself how to play Go, but also became the world champion in just three days. Yup, that's right, just three days. Talk about a prodigy, huh? And to add a cherry on top, it even outperformed its earlier version, which had defeated the world champion Lee Settle. Poor human pros, spending years mastering the game only to be dethroned by a machine. But wait, don't lose hope, dear viewers. Today, we'll unravel the fascinating tale of how one human managed to trick a super-intelligent AI into making a colossal blunder, proving that sometimes, our squishy human brains can still outsmart the cold, calculating circuits of a machine. Welcome to our channel, In Wonder. We are going to witness the ultimate showdown between human ingenuity and artificial intelligence. Now let's rewind the clock a bit. Back in 2016, the world of artificial intelligence experienced a monumental event when a computer defeated a top human Go player. People were amazed and honestly, a bit scared by the sheer power of AI. But guess what? The tables have turned, and we have a remarkable tale to tell. Meet Kellen Polreen, an American Go player who's just one rank below the top amateurs. In a stunning twist of fate, Kellen managed to outsmart a top-tier AI system, not once or twice, but in 14 out of 15 games. Talk about a thrilling comeback for humanity. But here's the fascinating part. Kellen's victory revealed a hidden vulnerability in the world's most advanced Go programs, a weakness that extends to many AI systems we use today, like the ChatGPT chatbot developed by OpenAI. And you know what's even more intriguing? Kellen discovered this Achilles heel through another machine. That's right, a machine helped him defeat its own kind. But worry not, Kellen achieved this impressive feat without any assistance during the actual games. He faced the AI head-to-head, -head, proving that human intuition and creativity still have a place in this ever-evolving technological landscape. So what does this mean for the future of AI and human intelligence? Let's dive deeper into this captivating story and explore the possibilities. A computer program developed to find flaws in AI systems made Kellen's unexpected victory possible. This ingenious software handed Kellen the strategy that would bring humans back to the top of the Go world. Adam Gleave, the CEO of FAR AI, the California-based research company that developed this groundbreaking program, revealed how they found a blind spot in Kenago, one of the top Go playing systems. By letting Kellen play more than a million games against Katago, the program taught him a way to win that was both effective and easy to use. In Kellen's words, this strategy is not absolutely basic, but it's not super difficult to learn. And guess what? He didn't just stop at defeating one AI system. Kellen used the same approach to conquer Leela Zero, another taco program. So here we are, seven years after it seemed AI had secured an insurmountable lead in what is often regarded as the most complex board game. Yet humans have made a triumphant return, all thanks to the tactics provided by you guessed it, another computer. This incredible story reminds us that the line between human and artificial intelligence is ever-shifting. As we continue to push the boundaries of technology, who knows what new surprises and alliances await us on the horizon? In 2016, World Go champion Lee Settle faced off against DeepMind's AlphaGo system in a battle that ended in a crushing defeat for the human player. The score was 4-2. Fast forward three years, and Settle decided to retire from the game, dubbing AI an entity that cannot be defeated. But Kellen Polreen's victories have shown us that even the seemingly invincible have their weak spots. In Go, players strategically place black and white stones on a 19x19 grid, aiming to surround their opponent's stones 
and claim as much territory as possible. With a mind-boggling number of possible moves, computers can analyze every potential outcome. So how did Kellen exploit the AI's weakness? He patiently formed a large loop of stones, encircling one of his opponent's groups while the AI was focused elsewhere. Surprisingly, the Go-playing robot was blind to this vulnerability until it was nearly too late, a vulnerability that would be glaringly obvious to a human player. Stuart Russell, a professor of computer science at UC Berkeley, says that this news about the best Go-playing robots shows a major flaw in the deep learning algorithms that power the most advanced AI systems today. They can only understand a limited range of scenarios based on their past experiences, struggling with the kind of generalization that comes naturally to humans. Russell's take-home message We've been too quick to assign superhuman intelligence to machines. Even though AI has come a long way, Kellen Porine's story shows that the human mind, with its creativity and ability to change, is still a force to be reckoned with. So you might be wondering what caused these high-powered AI systems to falter. Well, there's some intriguing speculation among the academic community. Adam Glebe, the CEO of Far AI, suggests that the AI systems may not have been trained on enough games like the one Kellen exploited, simply because the approach he used is so rarely seen. This lack of exposure left the AI unprepared for Kellen's clever strategy. Glebe also points out that the Go playing machines experienced an adversarial attack a type of challenge that often uncovers vulnerabilities in AI systems. Yet, despite these known weaknesses, we're still seeing massive AI systems being deployed on a large scale without proper verification. Kellen's experience with the GoBot highlights an interesting aspect of AI behavior. The bot failed to recognize its vulnerability until it was almost too late, while for a human player, spotting such an opening would be relatively easy. But this phenomenon doesn't just apply to the world of board games, it has real-world implications too. Take the insurance industry, for example. If things were more predictable, companies could have planned premium increases and reserve replenishments well in advance. However, the recent drops in their stock prices suggest that many carriers may have been unprepared. This vulnerability in AI systems extends to anti-fraud measures as well. Fraudsters could use AI to look for security flaws in data and algorithms. This is a real possibility that requires constant vigilance. When it comes to data-driven predictions, AI systems tend to be skewed toward the center of the distribution, as that's where most information lies. However, a normal distribution has limited information at its extremes. If these rare events happen more often, AI systems may become biased which could lead to wrong predictions and results that no one could have expected. All of this is a good reminder that even though AI has made great strides in many fields, it's still important to know its limits and make sure that humans continue to bring their unique perspectives and problem-solving skills to the table. Now that we've been discussing the limitations of AI, it's important to recognize the areas where it truly shines. One such domain is the automation of predictable and repetitive tasks. By taking over these jobs, AI enables workers to focus on higher value activities that benefit from human intuition and experience. Imagine a world where professionals can concentrate on tasks that require creativity, empathy, and complex problem solving, while AI systems handle mundane and repetitive work this could lead to increased productivity, job satisfaction, and even innovation. Another area where AI excels is in tackling the challenge of unstructured data, such as the information found in invoices, broker's slips, and medical records. By quickly analyzing and extracting insights from this data, AI can give claims adjusters or systems that make decisions clear. Actionable information that saves both time and money these examples show how AI has the potential to change industries, speed up processes, and make our everyday lives better. While it's crucial to be aware of AI's limitations, let's not forget the incredible benefits it can offer when leveraged effectively. So there you have it. We've explored the fascinating world of AI, its triumphs and vulnerabilities, 
and the dynamic interplay between human ingenuity and machine intelligence. As we continue to push the boundaries of technology, we find ourselves in a thrilling era where the line between human and artificial intelligence is constantly shifting. But here's a thought-provoking question for you. How can we harness the best of both worlds, the creativity and intuition of humans and the precision and efficiency of AI? to build a brighter, more innovative future for all of us. Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more mind-blowing content. Until next time.